Image National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration by Nicole Galucci the 2nd of September 2019 15 hours 31 minutes and 57 seconds coordinated universal time Hurricane Dorian is currently wreaking havoc on Grand Bahama Island and is expected to move towards Florida, South Carolina, North Carolina and Georgia over the coming days. The storm, which was originally forecast to make landfall along the Atlantic coast of Florida this weekend, edged farther east to slam the Bahamas. Dorian is now a Category 5 hurricane that's gained winds of up to 165 miles per hour, and is reportedly the strongest storm the world has seen in 2019. 12 ZHRRR shows Grand Bahama Island staying in. Going through the eyewall of a Category 4 or 5 hurricane is bad enough, but I can't even begin to fathom what it's like to be in one for more than an entire day. Sad face. Statement warning residents that this is a life-threatening situation, with wind gusts expected to reach 200 miles per hour, destructive waves, and a storm surge of 18 to 23 feet above normal tide levels. If you're looking to help the communities affected by Hurricane Dorian, here are some actions you can take and charities you can support. International Medical Corps At the request of the Florida Department of Health, the International Medical Corps, a global humanitarian non-profit that focuses on emergency response and relief, is deploying medical teams to the state. You can donate here to help the organization deliver health care and supplies to those impacted by Dorian, and learn more about the International Medical Corps response plan on site. St. Bernard Project St. Bernard Project SBP is a non-profit disaster relief organization that helps communities rebuild and recover long term. The organization is currently taking donations that will help fund protective equipment for volunteers by mucking and gutting supplies, and new flooring and mold removal for flooded homes. Heart to Heart International The team at Heart to Heart is tracking Dorian and deployed a disaster response team on August. 30, which includes the mobile medical unit, two support vehicles, and four logistics experts. The organization also has a disaster response team member in North Carolina and disaster response medical volunteers stationed in Florida. The team is monitoring the storm's impact on the Bahamas and is currently reaching out to partners to determine how to help there as well. You can support Heart to Heart's Dorian medical aid efforts here. Americas Americas is a non-profit disaster relief organization that focuses on emergency medical care and global health care. In wake of Hurricane Dorian, the organization has vowed to match every donation made to families affected by the storm and similar disasters. All Hands and Heart Smart Response The more than 57,000 volunteers at All Hands and Heart Smart Response are dedicated to providing natural disaster relief and are closely monitoring Hurricane Dorian. You can sign up as a volunteer at Aid in Relief First Hand, or donate to the organization's Dorian Recovery Fund. Direct Relief Direct Relief is a humanitarian organization with a presence in more than 80 countries. Its team has emergency medical caches stationed in Florida, the Carolinas, and along the Gulf Coast, and are ready to provide first aid supplies to those in need through formal agreements with the Caribbean Disaster Emergency Management Agency. The Organization of Eastern Caribbean States, the Pan-American Health Organization, and dozens of NGO and government entities, including in the Bahamas, Direct Relief is able to deploy emergency resources rapidly, according to Direct Relief's website. You can learn more about the organization's efforts on site and donate to Dorian Relief efforts here. Direct Relief's emergency response teams in the Southeast U.S. And the Caribbean are coordinating with local and state-level response agencies to route critical medical resources as needed in the immediate aftermath of 
pig.twitter.com slash i2 vooyo direct relief at direct relief september 1st 2019 good 360 good 360 a virginia based charity organization has been monitoring the storm and is looking to assist non-profits in need of product donations Good360 is currently taking donations from both corporations and individuals and is requesting water, personal care items, portable charges, diapers, tarps, pillows, sheets and blankets to help those impacted by Dorian. You can also use Charity Navigator to stay up to date as more trusted organizations offer the support and get advisories and new information about Hurricane Dorian from the National Hurricane Center. Please stay safe. Let's block ads. Why?